Hi everyone, I'm Katalin and this is my first voiceover video and I hope you'll enjoy it. Stickers are a big part of Counter-Strike and some of them can get crazy expensive like the iPy Power and Titan Holos from Katowice 2014. Since the update which added the new sticker system which allow 5 stickers on each weapon with custom positions, everyone talked about what possibilities this would unlock and they're not wrong. But in this video I want to talk about stickers that nobody used. You all know the Dreamhack 2014 stickers which in my opinion are some of the best, that's why I rocked this AK-47 and I don't think I'll change it very soon. There are currently 16 team stickers that you can get in paper variant and some of them have uh, holo, foil and gold variations. These are Fnatic, Penta, NIP, Navi, Virtus Pro, ESK or ESK Gaming, Cloud9, MyXMG, LDLC, Hellraisers, Bravado Gaming, Dignitas, Copenhagen Wolves, Flipside, Planet Key Dynamics and I Buy Power. In this video I want to show you 4 more stickers that you probably never knew existed. There are, in the game files, 4 team stickers that don't appear on any skins. Mouse Esports, 3D Max, Dead Team and The London Conspiracy. So why are those there though? Because of the souvenir cases. They all have gold variants and you can actually get those stickers in-game. On a souvenir skin but only 3D Max and London Conspiracy. Why only 2? Honestly, I don't know and didn't really look into it, but if someone can explain this to me or if you want me to look it up in another video, tell me in the comments. Also, if you're interested in CS2 skin artworks or CS2 skins in news in general, you can follow my Twitter which is in this video's description. Thank you all for watching and have a blessed day and gold gold gold.